In this tutorial, we'll create a simple animation to demonstrate how easy it is to work with Web Animator. We'll design a scene where the Web Animator logo, a short text, and the icon will fly on our screen. First of all, drag an image object on your stage and choose the image you want to use from your collection. Now, scale and position the image at the top of your stage. After that, Drag the text object on the stage, change it according to needs and set the font size to 40 pixels. The logo and the text shall fade in and move from the top to the bottom of your stage. Now, set the image opacity to zero in order to make it invisible and move both objects to the start, exactly in the same position they were in at the beginning. After that, move the time slider to 0.5 seconds and enable the animation mode by clicking on Record. When we use the Record mode in Web Animator, the program stores every object property we change and automatically creates the necessary keyframes for us, pictured on the timeline as small dots. When you move the time slider back and forth, you can see how our two objects move and fade in onto the stage. Both objects shall remain 0.5 seconds on the stage, then disappear again. You then move the time slider to one second and click on keyframe. Web Animator will create new keyframes on the timeline with the current value of the object properties. Drag the time slider to 1.5 seconds and change the opacity again to zero. Our two objects now disappear from the stage. In the last part of our animation, the Web Animator icon shall fly in on the stage and rotate 180 degrees. To do this, you will have to drag the image object on your stage again and pick the icon file. Make it a bit bigger and center it on the stage, then rotate it 180 degrees on the Z-axis and set it as invisible by balancing the opacity to zero. Now switch back to the record mode, drag the time slider to 2 seconds and change the opacity back to 1. Web Animator will now create the keyframes for us again. Set back the rotation property on our z-axis to 0 and our icon will instantly rotate back 180 degrees. Web Animator has created the start keyframes at position 0 seconds. We want our logo to appear at 1.5 seconds. To see this, simply drag the start keyframes of our icon to the appropriate time location. Ok, let's take a first look at our animation by clicking on Preview and check it out in the browser.